What's up guys, welcome to the channel, it's Dusty, one half of our radiant gaming and let's 100% burning, turning power plant in Kirby and the Forgotten Land. First thing you're going to have to do is after you get out of the area that crushes you, go to the top right and right behind in a wolfie is a cup of coffee. This is your first of three cups of coffee. And after you get this coffee, hit the switch and then go through the next crushing area. There will be some boxes to the right in the crushing area. Break these boxes and then go into that area to get your first hit Waddle Dee. Directly after you get that Waddle Dee, jump out of the hole and then run to the left down a secret hallway into the control room. That's all you have to do for this one is go into that control room. Then as you're going past the treadmill that pushes you backwards, there will be your second cup of coffee sitting to the top of your screen. This is two out of three cups of coffee. Then be sure to get all five of the green star pieces while going on the treadmill. Some of them are a little difficult to find, but they're not spread out very far. Get all of these and this is your second hidden waddle dee. The hardest one for me to find was the one that is on top of the crusher. Then after you get out of the crushing area, you will see another crushing area that isn't big enough to fit through. Go back towards you and you will see a lantern to light. Light it and then you'll be able to fit through that area that you couldn't fit through before. Go through that area and follow the coins to go into the secret room. When you're in that secret room, light the fuse and then get the stairs with mouthful mode to maneuver around the fire so it doesn't go out. Then place them on the switch, jump on them, and then jump in the cannon before your fire dust so it'll shoot you up and you will get your third hidden waddle dee. This is three of five. Then when you're getting chased by the spiky wall, your last cup of coffee will actually be down towards the bottom of your screen before you drop down into the hole. This is three of three cups of coffee. Then as you're getting chased by the spikes, be sure to grab the vending machine. After you get it, drop down, go through destroying everything, and then you'll see an area to bust through a garage door. Once you do this, Go around to the other side and get your fourth hidden waddle dee. Then at the end, as you fit through the walls in different shapes, keep the cone ability and bust through the floor right in front of the last waddle dee. This is your final waddle dee. And then if you made it through the whole level without getting squished by anything, you have 100% of this level. Best way to do this, in my opinion, is to use the fire ability. You guys hear me say that all the time. You just jump and click B so you can burst through everything. But when the things drop through the ceiling, I actually just go on top of them when I can so I don't get squished. Then, of course, save your last three waddledees and you have completed them 100% of this course. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. I really appreciate it. If you liked it, be sure to hit the like button. Also, subscribe and turn on the bell so you don't miss a video. My wife and I do stream over on Twitch and the link is in the description if you would like to check that out. This is one half of Our Radiant Gaming signing off. Everyone have an awesome day and God bless.